The <laughs> Pentagon has confirmed a strange and unexpected sight captured by Navy personnel off the coast of California. The video shows flying pyramid-shaped objects hovering above the USS Russell and another warship. Mm. It was leaked by filmmaker Jeremy Corbell. Uh, he's also shared three images from the USS Omaha showing an unknown spherical craft. The Pentagon has confirmed its unidentified aerial phenomena task force, what a task force that is, <laughs> is examining the footage. Creator and editor of ExtraordinaryBeliefs.com, Jeremy Corbell joins us now. Jeremy, incredible vision. What sets this apart from other UFO sightings captured in the past? Yeah, it's, it's a pleasure, David and Nat. Nice to be with you. Nice to be with you, Australia. This is a truly global story. What separates this footage compared to other UFO footage you might see is that the U.S. Navy photographed and filmed these pyramid-shaped UFOs and transmedium vehicles. And I obtained, as a journalist, I obtained and released some of this historic footage with my mentor in journalism, George Knapp, and this has now, as you said, been directly confirmed by the Pentagon. So that is significant in and of itself, how quickly they confirmed that these reports are contained within their educational uh, briefings for, mm. for individuals what, in the military. What's a transmedium vehicle? Great question. So important. What they witnessed at the, with the USS Omaha was uh, an object that was able to break the air to sea barrier without destruction. So transmedium means it can move between air, space and sea without destruction or impact. And that's so what no they're splash. seeing with these true unknowns. So the US mm -hmm. Navy, someone on a ship uh, attached to the US Navy shot it, did they? Well, there's a lot of sensor systems on these ships, as you can imagine. I only released non-classified or unclassified imagery I was able to get my hands on, those videos. That's a hard thing to do. But of course, there are other systems that are completely classified. These are highly documented. Look, they're coming to our warships and surrounding them on a mass scale. And this isn't the first thing. This has been going on for a long time. You're just seeing an open Jeez. government policy now Okay. to talk about it. The Pentagon is expected to release a report on its findings in June. But what do you think it's going to show? And will they be honest? So this new candor is astonishing. You know, after so many decades of outright lies and, you know, along with ridicule by world governments. I mean, the U.S. government, the Australian government, the U.K., they're all guilty of it, and they all work together on this. But what we're seeing now is we're seeing uh, changes in that environment, and that's what has started this congressional dig into this UFO topic and this, you know, report that we're going to be getting. Well, now, because of what I released with George Knapp, They've got even more to talk about and explain. So you're saying our government's been lying about extraterrestrial life along with the US government? Whatever this is, whatever is represented by these advanced aerospace vehicles, I don't, I'm not saying it's extraterrestrial. I have no idea. That would be our oh. government's position to tell us. But they've been lying that this has been happening. And so now the cat's out of the bag, toothpaste out of the, out of, out of the tube. We're seeing a different type of attitude of world governments and, and frankly it's right. good we have a, a right to know and a need to know as public uh, in america australia and around yep. the world yep. we will it's keep something. in touch when that report comes out yeah. in june we'll talk to you again to see what it reveals yeah. and it's something up there yeah. you know what I mean? yeah. thank yeah, you for you'll, you'll see more on my social media soon oh. this week yeah oh, oh okay, okay that's a tease yep. we'll, we'll follow you now thank you so much for joining us we appreciate it so great. Yes, Australia. Nice. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Your beauty. I love Americans. <laughs> <laughs>